Repay Roy. Anna then invites Roy to go surfing on the beach with her. Halfway there, Anna suddenly noticed that Roy seemed to like porpoises. The same as the one on her surfboard. Even the song he liked to listen to was also her favorite song. The two of them couldn't help but sing along. It was Roy's first time on a surfboard, so he wasn't very good at it. Anna has been teaching him for a long time, and he still can't learn. But he's a great cook, and he makes good coffee. He was a great conversationalist. He often made Anna blush. Gradually, they grew closer. Whenever they had time, they would go to the beach and surf together. Under her tutelage, she taught him how to surf and he got better and better. As time went by, as the relationship progressed, Anna fell more and more in love with this sunny, handsome boy. In the sunset sunlight, the two of them finally held hands. They were officially together. Like many couples in love, Roy and Anna spent almost every day together. They traveled to many places. They watched the fireworks together. As long as Anna was by Roy's side, he couldn't see anything else in his eyes. Because what Roy loved most was the waves Anna made when she surfed. On Roy his birthday, Anna gave him a giant inflatable porpoise. The two of them had their photo taken together. They had a great time together. It was Christmas time. They went to a building that was known as a mecca for couples. They wrote their wish on the top floor of the building that they would be together forever. The sky was suddenly filled with snow. Anna was first excited and then disappointed. It was rumored that if she rode the waves after a snowfall, the wish would come true. But she had to work tomorrow, so she can't go surfing on the beach.